Jesus Christ. My predecessor was unfortunately destroyed, but Cyberlife transferred its memory and sent me to replace it. You died in my arms. And now you're back here as if nothing happened. Fuck you. What? I guess saving him didn't mean anything. This is when we learned that Hank is not a robot, or he's a robot. The Turing test, and he's the founder of Cyberlife. Anybody can tell us about Deviants, it's him. The founder of Cyberlife really like Blade Runner, apparently. <laughs> you haven't seen Blade Runner? I really recommend it. It's a banger movie. The originals are a little bit like an acquired taste, but 2040, uh, 2049, I think it's called, is a great one. Oh, it's the girl from the main menu. That's so meta. <laughs> uh, I'm uh, Lieutenant Hank Anderson, Detroit Police Department. I'm here to see uh, Mr. Elijah Kamsky. Please, come in. I'm just happy I, I recognized it. I'm sure it was a reference. This is no way it wasn't. I'll let Elijah know you're here, but please make yourself comfortable. Nice girl. Oh, that's the one uh, I've seen in my mind. You're right. Amanda. That's what she was called. I forgot. Wait, she died? Really pretty. Not even alive. Nice place. Then who's in my brain? Because androids haven't been a bad thing for everybody. You're about to meet your maker, Connor. How's it feel? Kamsky is one of the great geniuses of the 21st century. It'll be interesting to meet him in person. I just want to say that to ha you have, a, if you have a <laughs> Android saying that its creator is one of the greatest geniuses of the century that's leaning into the Oba uh, obama giving himself a metal meme a little bit too much that'd be like a honda saying that the honda creators are the best ow she doesn't agree sometimes i wish i could meet my creator face to I think face about that. i'd have a couple of things i'd want to tell him damn Elijah, we'll see you now. Oh, let's go. Perfect. You just have to read about Jeffrey Bezos. We have hand cam on now? It should be off, right? Oh, it's off now. Whoa. Mr. Camp Red pool? Now, this is really Blade Runner. Just hold on, please. God damn. Yeah, it was for the alerts. Damn, he has a type. He kind of looks like the... He literally looks like the dude from Blade Runner. Okay, I can't get over to all these... <laughs> you did it. There it is. Bezos. It's Jeffrey, Jeffrey Bezos. Bezos. Jeffrey Bezos. That is so loud. Thank what you, bro. That's but prime. He literally reminds me so much of that dude. He left Cyberlife years ago, but... I was hoping you'd be able to tell us something we don't know. Same actor as Gavin. Deviants. Fascinating, aren't they? Yeah, right. Perfect this beings with infinite intelligence. Oh, they got made into integration. Okay. Machines are so superior to us. This was just like the dude from Blade Runner. The dude who was in the big triangle. Humanity's right? greatest achievement. He literally looks like him too. Same mannerisms. Except that one was blind. This guy isn't blind. Something in the Deviant's program seems to emulate emotion. Jared Leto? Is that the one? Maybe it was. You might know something about how that occurs. All ideas of viruses spread like epidemics. I don't know actors so well. be free a contagious disease. Listen, I didn't come here to talk philosophy. The machines you created may be planning a revolution. Either you can tell us something that'll be helpful, or we will be on our way. What about you, Connor? 
Whose side are you on? Damn. I'll be neutral. I have no side. I was designed to stop deviance, and that's what I intend to do. <laughs> well, that's what you're programmed to say. But you. What do you really want? Troubled. I'll be honest, I'll be troubled. Why not? What I want is not important. Chloe? Uh -oh. I'm sure you're familiar with the Turing test. Your formality. Simple question of algorithms and computing capacity. What interests me is whether machines are capable of empathy. I call it the Kamsky test. It's very simple, you'll see. Magnificent, isn't it? One of the first intelligent models developed by CyberLife. Young and beautiful forever. All right, calm down. A flower that will never wither. Bruh. What is it really? A piece of plastic containing a human? Or a living being? Oh, no, it's, it's a so gun, isn't it? It's up to you to answer that fascinating question, Connor. Damn! Destroy this machine, and I'll tell you all I know. Or spare it, if you feel it's alive. But you'll leave here without having learned anything from me. Oh, wow. All right. Okay, I think we're done here. Come on. You did it! Sorry to get you. Jeffrey Bezos! Jeffrey Bezos! Oh my god. <laughs> He's gonna keep doing I need to set up a do I have that alert box in this one? I do, right? Oh my god. with free will. That's enough. Connor will Oh, thank you for the bribe, Skater. Don't and I'll tell you what you wanna know. Oh, this is hard. Shoot or don't shoot. Hank wants to leave. Oh my god. I'm 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 conflicted. I'm conflicted. If I if I shoot, I prove I'm a robot. If I don't shoot, I prove I'm not a robot. Hank doesn't want me to shoot. He wants he wants me to be a deviant, but why does he want that? This dude seems psycho. Maybe he wants to screw over the new gents. A, a deviant would not shoot. We're not shooting. For the sake of Hank. I already almost killed myself just to save Hank. Cyberlife's last chance to save humanity. Is itself a deviant? Damn. I'm, I'm not a deviant. You prefer to spare a machine rather than accomplish your mission. You saw a living being in this android. You showed empathy. Okay, so I just want to say something, because every time they say this, they assume that, oh, you saw something living in this and that. <laughs> you guys have heard of my reasoning. I didn't spare her because I see her as a person or a living being. I spared her because I'm concerned what Hank thinks. I have the same amount Stop. of... I have the same amount of... I was going to say, like, empathy... As a robot, I'm not a deviant. I'm just trying to think one step ahead. <laughs> Stop assuming I'm a deviant just because I'm trying to think about what my what consequences my actions have. It's all for Hank. Yeah. Twitch Prime. Don't no forget it. Coming. Jeffrey Bezos. You'll have to choose your side. Will you betray your own people or stand up against your creators? What can be worse than having to choose between two evils? Let's get out of here. By the way, I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. 
You never know. Emergency exit. <laughs> Hank job. Wow. Why didn't you shoot? I just saw that girl's eyes. And I couldn't. That's all. You're always saying you would do anything to accomplish your mission. That was our chance to learn something, and you let it go. Yeah, I know what I should have done. I told you I couldn't. I'm sorry, okay? I was just concerned about Hank. Well, maybe you did the right thing. Damn. Well, now we're, Hank's a friend, so now it works out in the end. <laughs> Can't make the Jeff Bezos thing in lower volume. Yeah, I really should, shouldn't I? If you guys give me a second, I'll fix that, because it was really loud. I, I absolutely agree. I hate when I do that. You think there's gonna be more of a sequence and walk to the edge? Okay. Parkour robot sponsored by Nikes. Just gonna scan the area real quick. Assassin's Creed robot. Assassin's Creed Detroit. I needed to see the daylight. I like it here. I come here often. It's like being alone with the world. Lord, huh? We freed hundreds of our people and they're still coming from all over the city. Those who dream of freedom come to Jericho. Something's changing. You seem preoccupied. Hey, we unlocked something. Let's they do all that. Obey me. They follow me without question. And that much power feels good. Robot Jesus. It's scary. At the same time. All the media are talking about what we did last night. The humans are terrified. I'm just gonna say, it feels a bit inconvenient that she has her hair underneath the clothes. I feel like you would want them above it. But maybe it's a thing so you get some more, uh, what's the word? Agility? Flexibility? Determined. If they won't listen, we'll fight. You haven't said much about yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? Okay, let's say it. Truth. I was caring for an old man. He was like a father to me. He wasn't like he a father to me. And androids can't live together. <laughs> what about you? Companion, you let's go, past. baby. What did you do before? Old you man was like father to me. Why do you hate humans so much? There must be a reason. I told you, I don't want to talk about it. How does this game have difficulties? It's a story game. There's not any mechanics or anything. North, we're fighting together. We have to know things about each other to trust each other. I was nothing. Damn. A doll in a distributor program to satisfy humans. Oh no. Just a toy designed for their pleasure. One day I was with a man who rented me. Now I know why she's so extreme. And without knowing why, I realized I couldn't take it anymore. Did you kill him? I strangled him and I ran away. Oh no, just like the ones at the club. There, now you know everything. Connect. Are we gonna do the avatar sex? Like from the movie, not from the last airbender. Wait, where are we? 
I think we just did that. <laughs> I, I saw your memories. She's a lover? Carl Wait. Was, what? That was a big step. I saw your memories too. The Eden Club. The, the death of that man. I felt like I was there with you. North. Damn. There's a lot to unpack. Is that Simon? He made it. Why does he look so angry? I'd be happy that Simon was back. Awesome. I'll get out. If you saw him take the other android's eyes and his memories, maybe? I can see that. This is suicide. We'll all be killed. Please, Marcus. It's not too late to change your mind. You don't understand. We're finally going to show them who we really are. This place will go down in his... Wait, what? This is like the opposite of what North always wants to do the risky thing and now she wants to do the safe thing. Is this because of the robot sex? We'll be killed on the spot. That's a risk I'm prepared to take if it means freedom for our people. Marcus, please don't do this. They'll understand. We'll make them understand. This is the only way. Gotta keep doing the opposite of what North wants. It seems to have worked so far. There are androids here who could join us. The more we are, the stronger our message. All right, time to touch him a little bit. You're free. Baby, Baby robot. Was there really only one we could touch? Oh, there's one over here. But like we could have brought more androids, I'm gonna be honest with you. <sighs> You're awake now. Damn. Easy way to break for security. There's a robot right here, right? He's just gonna walk away from his owner, drop the bags on the floor. Come with us. <laughs> Bellini paints. Oh, that's a throwback. I was just like you, and then I went to the Bellini paint store, and everything changed. Block the road. All right. It's gonna go touch a lot of people. You're free. Touch people. The game. Start with your dad. Simulator 2020. Can I, can I get all these guys? I need to block the street. It, it's... I don't know what I think about them all looking the same. I guess it's a good thing, but it kind of... If I would choose a roster, I wouldn't choose a roster of workers all that look the same. Bro, I just gave up. You are free. Oh, okay. Sorry, forgot about the railroad. I want to touch these guys real quick. No, nope. okay, never mind. 
Listen, man, don't make a game where I'm supposed to go touch people and then not let me touch people. There we go. What else is this? What else is that? Convert more Android. Let's go touch people. Let's go, baby. Serve these guys. I can just look at people and they convert now? What the hell? What is this Robo Jesus stuff? Is he gonna break out of the window? Telepathic conversion. Yeah. He's just pointing at them. Oh, whoops. Am I supposed to turn around? <laughs> This is a lot about religion and society. And now I'm just gonna conveniently hack that screen as well. Yep, okay. I see what we're doing, but... <laughs> God damn, where's this power coming from? It really just comes out of nowhere. Now I have to all donate $50 to again and get access to Jericho Plus. Damn, there's a lot of people. I mean, I, I know why they did it gameplay-wise. It would really suck if you go and touch everyone. But now you're not even touching them anymore. This sort of breaks the spirit of the game. There's one of you and a hundred of us. Don't do it, old man. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> this bed is patrol 457. I like the one that's applauding in the side. I like that. That's someone that likes androids. We are people. Freedom, liberty, for android, equal rights. We are people. We are people. Equal rights. I oh, look, they're like applauding on the street and stuff. That's so cute. Crap, it's a police. Got big guns. You can't shoot us. The public perception will go crazy. Oh god. Oh god, they got the tanks. Last time I heard about a protest and tanks, things did not end up very well for the people. That's all I'm gonna say. We came here to demonstrate peacefully and tell humans that we are living beings. All we want is to live free. This is an elite. <laughs> imagine Siri calling for equal rights. <laughs> yeah, dude, imagine you just pick up your phone and start screaming about equal rights. I would be confused. Immediately or we will open fire. That's such a... He looks way too smug with that. We've done no harm. We have no intention of doing any. But know that we are not going anywhere until we have secured our freedom. I repeat, this is an illegal gathering. Doesn't have the proper permits. Immediately, we will shoot. Marcus, they're gonna kill us. We have to attack. There's more of us. We can take them. 
Do the opposite of what North wants. Easy. We have to show them we're not violent. We should just stand our ground, even if it means dying here. He's right. Dying here won't solve anything. Marcus, we need to go now before it's too late. Leave is the option. We can be martyrs, or we can walk away. Disperse. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! We're leaving. Affirmative. On my orders! Run! Stay, charge, disperse. Run! This is perfect. I'm only admired by Jericho now. This is good. This is a good thing. Come on, Marcus. We gotta go. Exactly. They look evil. We're turning public perception. I was ready to die for this, but we can't have all of us die. If you stay, Jericho relationship is unaffected. Okay, well, so if I'd rather have all of us run. We still gotta live to see another fight. Oh, we really missed out on a lot, didn't we? By running. Anyways, yeah. It, the point was, you can't attack them. It's all. It's we're robots. We're expendable. And I just picked up a random bunch of dudes on the street by touching them. I don't need, you know, to to uh, <laughs> fight for my life here. I'm just trying to make the public perception change. We're playing the long con.